guys welcome back to my channel if you're just tuning in thank you for joining us and if you're a returning subscriber yo 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 all right my name is ono shukwe and this is ono shukwe vibe and i feel about faith learning lifestyle my tribe and maybe relationships okay all right so today like you can tell you it is a q and a session about your girl all right, and without wasting much of our time, let's jump right into it. Okay, so I had to write them down so that I won't miss any of them. And I don't see any possibility of finishing all this in one video, but you, wherever we stop, we're going to continue from there. Okay? Well, first of all, outfit check, check, check. Do you guys like my hair? Nice? Let me know in the comment section if you want us to do a hair routine. Okay, this is all mine. All right, question number one What is your name, guys? My name is Priska Onoshukwe Amo. Okay, question number two How old are you? Hmm, I am 28 years old. Yeah. 28 years old and I clocked 28 in March 28 interesting guys yes question number three marital status you is real is real is real I'm married okay we'll talk about that in another video entirely all right number of children oh well none for now don't have any child as of the moment okay favorite verse Favorite verse of the scripture, you will have a lot of them. But recently, I kind of resonate with Ecclesiastes 3 verse 18. Hmm? Want to check it out? KJV. Whatsoever the Lord do it, he'll finish it. And then um, he, you can add to it, you can subtract from it. And he do it so that men may fear him. A paraphrase. Check it out, guys. Okay, what church do you attend is the next question you elevation church yeah that's the church i attend favorite meal rice 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 again yes morning afternoon night brunch whatever it is just give you good rice and we're good to go <laughs> okay now favorite perfume you, I don't have any favorite perfume. Anything I see, full, and I'm out. But come to think of it, my boss's wife, a couple of years ago, gave me a jadore for for a gift, and I completely loved that perfume. I loved it, but for now, I don't have a favorite perfume. That's it. Hair or shoes. You can tell hair, but that doesn't mean I don't like shoes. But then, maybe I won't just queue for it. Okay. Why YouTube? All right, guys. So I sat down and I've been ruminating on it for a while. I was looking for a channel that I could actually put to the world that would bless lives out there. Okay, something that the content will be so 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 needful. Okay. All right. And as authentic as possible and also my try part of it I didn't see anything like that happening so far so I felt you know what this girl should do something and trust God that she survives it okay all right why do what do I get to sorry what do I get to gain if I subscribe to your channel hmm that's interesting guys you know no man is an island, right? And we keep on learning. We just keep on learning. You never can tell that little thing you might just get from somewhere and it will get your world starting. Okay? It's 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 a world and it's revolving. Alright? So I'm just going to trust God that contents from here are going to bless you one way or the other. It's going to speak to your life one way or the other. In Jesus' name. Amen. Okay? What is your hobby, guys? Lately, YouTube channels. I watch YouTube channels. I am glued to my phone and I'm watching YouTube channels. And the next question is saying, who are your favorite channels? Like, what's your favorite YouTube channel? I have a lot of them. A lot, but 
Nigerian base. I'm going to narrow it down. I love Abimbola curry. Skinny girl in transit Tiwa. Yes. I love how real she is, how humble she is, and how truthful. Like, it's just this plain. I love that about her. And a couple I follow again is Tolu Lokwe Solutions. Solutions, Mama. Yo, yo, if you ever get to see this, you inspire me. All right? So that's it for Nigerian bees. Let's leave it at that. Um, saddest experience ever. Yo, guys. Saddest? Hmm. I think that would be like nine years ago. I practically watched my mama took her last breath. Yo, I think lately that's the most saddest thing that I have ever experienced, guys. In May, I think 26 is going to be a year. Did I say year? Nine years, sorry. Nine years. Nine years. Yes. And just in case you're out there and you think everything is gone, like the last breath, somebody you so loved, a dear one, just gave up on you, please please time they say heals everything you see that thing it is true god in the picture and you will make it happen you don't need to be so down it's okay to cry it's okay to cry it's okay to wet your pillows but do not grieve in it all right just know that it's gonna take a step at a time and god is gonna fix you up trust me just keep staying all prayed up god is gonna be there for you all right so that's that for that your mom or your dad in terms of resemblance yo papa i look like my dad all right if you see me you don't need to look for him no more <laughs> yeah what's your type of hair guys people should help me out help a sister i don't even know this hair is not 3c is no 4c is no is any other c i don't know but all i know is it's rubber like you know when you have a, a a newborn baby and the way the hair draws that is the kind of texture the thing is please help me out in the comment section if it has a name but ain't 4c ain't 3c okay all right what comes so difficult with your hair yo guys when you want to plait this thing like it doesn't last oh it does not last you know natural hair journey then you see people they twist their hair twist lock flat twist and they take it for like a week or two and it's looking all you know dope and fine oh guys your girl can do that it wouldn't even stay for three days like it would just be so rough and you would be forced to tell me young woman go and losing your hair is unkept so i think that's the most difficult thing i've had to deal with with my hair the most difficult all right okay what hair products do you use hmm i'm going to give it to olive products i think i use their um shampoo and their conditioner and then dark and lovely conditioner does magic to my hair guys like it detangles everything when i just apply i can take my hands down from the scalp to the roots you know it just keeps going and going and i feel so good about it yeah i feel so good about it you just want to try it out okay and do what works for you mm? a lot of products are out there try and if it works just stick to it i don't do so much and you know what Ori is? Shea butter is my best friend when it comes to my hair. Okay, next question. What is your occupation, guys? Hmm, I teach and I enjoy it. I'm a tutor in a secondary school here in Lagos and I do online business. You, I sell clothing, hmm? all your, your clothing issues, just online. With my phone get pictures post today buy a few items that i can post today i get a buyer and then i sell okay so teaching business and lately youtube all right it's been amazing like so so amazing all right um 
toughest decision you've ever made guys i remember it clearly when i finished service i got a good job in lagos a good paid job in lagos and in between leaving that job and going for my master's degree was the toughest decision i have ever made like i was looking at the money and the benefits that came with the job and somebody saying you know go back to the class the rest of your go back there and study it wasn't easy okay guys this is one of the shortest videos like we'll be doing and um, subsequently and um i don't want it to be super long so we're going to end here and we'll continue with the questions subsequently now guys please please keep staying safe wash your hands adhere to every precautionary measures see we're going to refine you there'll be a time we still have to go out and party and you know just have our best times of our lives but for now let's take it a day at a time your mental sanity your mental health guys secure it guide it just a day at a time and i think it's the best time to actually stretch a healthy hand to anybody around you you don't need to give the world right anything little people are going through tough times guys please help somebody and um philippians 3 verse 6 okay i hope i'm not misquoting that scripture that is saying do not be anxious for nothing but in prayers and supplication make your questions known unto god okay please don't have panic attacks it's going to end we're going to see the end of it in jesus name so keep staying prayed up and um, we're gonna see you in the next video now please subscribe on your way out and um say something in the comment section on anything you want us to discuss and we'll be right here to talk about it thank you thank you thank you mm -hmm. bye